It smells weird in here. Moldy. You nervous? Your aura is all kinds of brown. Should I be? Oh, hey, I thought you didn't believe in all this. Horseshit is the term you used, if I remember correctly. I'd like to think I have an open mind. No, I have since when? Since you wouldn't shut up about it? <sighs> anyway, what could it hurt? And a couple of things I'd like to get off of my ample chest. Well, this will be good. How are you, anyway? I feel terrible that I haven't been more there for you. I'm fine. I've been drowning my sorrow in a string of casual tricks. And I've been having more sex than I did during my marriage. Say, where is this uh, psychic anyways? I've been waiting forever. Medium. It says psychic on the window. I think she's just finishing up with another client. Or making us wait for dramatic effect. She comes very highly recommended, okay? Flower from Living Foods says she has a real gift. You sure you're okay? Everyone keeps asking me that. Your husband just died. You just seem... I don't know. Am I supposed to be a blubbering wreck all the time? People handle death in their own way. Say, is this medium a gypsy? Oh, wow, wow, okay, you, can, you cannot say that anymore, okay? They like to be called Roma. It's pronounced Rama. Oh, oh I, I am so sorry about that. I am Madame Sharma, and you I, are? I, uh, I'm, I, I'm Jason, and this Why is... doesn't she tell me my name? Excuse me? Well, if you're a psychic. Medium. Medium. Then why do you ask our names? Shouldn't you already know? <laughs> He's one of those. What does that mean? A skeptic. Next you're going to be asking me why I didn't predict 9-11, or why I don't just play the lottery to win a hundred million dollars. And that's when I'll tell you, Alex, that it doesn't work that way. Did you tell her my name? Did you bring the items? How did you know my name? Hmm, you did bring them. They're in that bag. How do you know that? Well, it says psychic on the window. Shall we? Please, have a seat. Place the items on the table. When the seance begins, I will choose the one that belonged to the spirit that we're summoning today. Hey, how long is this going to take? I've got a, a conference call in the morning. However long you want it to. Don't worry. I'm paying for it. I charge by the half hour. Oh, you know, that's better than most hookers. Look, if you- no, I'm sorry, no, I, I, I apologize for him, please. Madam Sharma. I'm sorry. I'll give this a chance. Just get this over with. Give me your hands. And who are we contacting this evening? You want me to tell you. Mm. Your husband. His name is Daniel. Yes, that is his name. Let us begin. Close your eyes. Oh, 
you? Yes, it's Daniel. Is that Jason? Yeah, it, it is. Look, Daniel. Yes? There, there are three items on the table. Uh, one of them belongs to you. That's it? That's his. I, I didn't know he kept a diary. Alex? Is that you? It is I. Oh, Alex, baby. So glad you're here. Okay, I'm calling shenanigans. This is not Daniel. Alex. Really, Alex? I came all the way back from the spirit realm and you still act like a complete twat? Typical. And there he is. What the hell happened to me anyway? You're dead. No shit. Obviously we established that. How did I bite it? You don't remember? You died in a car accident. I've told you a million times you drive like a reckless moron. Even in death, you're still finding ways to criticize me. All right, you two, that's enough. How was my funeral? Well attended. Alex, tell me you didn't invite my bitch sister. She didn't want to come anyway. Well, I didn't want her there. It was a lovely service. The wake was a lot of fun. I met your friend, um, Tom. Couldn't at least wait until I was in the ground. It's not like you waited until I was dead. Oh, please. You guys. Why am I here anyway? Why was I pulled out of the ether of blissful oblivion? Did you miss me? Hardly. I wanted to talk to you. To both of you, actually. About what? About what's in that diary. Uh, I didn't know you even kept a diary. It's a journal. Diaries are for 12-year-old girls. There's some interesting things in it there. <gasps> I can't believe you read my journal. That's an invasion of privacy. You're dead! So what? It's fair game. Says who? Says the rules. What rules? If you wanted your secrets buried with you, idiot, then you shouldn't have kept a diary. Journal! Fine. Semantics. Journal. Guys. So now that you went through my private journal, what is it that you want to tell me? Us. It confirmed some suspicions. About what? Suspicions? That you two... Yeah? That you two were fucking! That, that... That's not true. Then why, why, why did he write about it in his oh-so-personal, oh-so-private, sad little book? And maybe we were? Daniel. I mean, I guess we got caught, so now what? I'm glad you're dead. That's what I really wanted to tell you. I'm glad too. It means I'm away from you forever. Alex, I'm sorry. It, just... it what? Just happened? Well, yeah, yeah, kind of. It just happened multiple times? <laughs> of all of the thousands of men, why did you have to fuck him, my husband? I don't know. I just. It just what? It was my fault. I like Jason. He's sweet and caring and a good kisser and an attentive lover, unlike you. How does it feel, Daniel? How does what feel? To be burning in hell! You want to hear a secret? There is no hell, asshole. Being married to you, that was hell. Alex. What? Hey! You're supposed to pay me! 
I'll pay you. That was fucking intense. I'll pay you extra. Wait, my heart's racing. My throat, it's dry. Okay, let's not milk it. Did you say everything you wanted to say? I did. He didn't write all that in his diary, journal. How'd you know about them? I have my own gifts. It's little things you pick up along the way. Sideways glances, lingering hugs. The dead giveaway was how both of them never spoke about the other. The absence was telling. It was all the evidence I needed. That, and I got into his phone maybe once or twice. <laughs> Just fucked up, you know? Planning a funeral for someone you didn't love. We should have split up years ago. Are you gonna forgive your friend? You tell me. I could, but I'm not going to. I'll get over it. Hey, I can milk the guilt for a while, get some free lunches and gifts out of it. <laughs> Talking like a true gypsy. I thought you people preferred Roma. Nah. Now, about the payment? The sordid topic of coin. That much? You gotta be fucking kidding me! <laughs>